Hello, this is a video to show you my new Orange Pi Zero Plus 2 that I got just one week ago in order to substitute my Raspberry Pi 2 that died a few months ago. So this is the web page of linuxunchi.org in which we can see the Orange Pi P0 Plus 2. This is an image of the single board computer. And we can see the specifications, a single on a chip H3 512 megabytes of RAM DDR3 and it's power uh, using a micro USB uh, 5 volts. I use the one of I had from the Raspberry Pi and it works perfectly. And then among other features I will highlight the 8 gigabytes of eMMC which is an uh, onboard storage uh, similar to the SSD in a, in a laptop. So what uh, operative system I use? We have several available uh, OS in the page of Orange Pi, but I prefer to use Armian, which is an open source uh, platform. And we see that the for, for the Orange Pi 02 Plus X3, we have two options, Ubuntu Server Legacy or Mainline. Mainline is still experimental, so I uh, decide to download the legacy. I flash it into an SD card. I input the SD card into the board and then I follow the instructions to install the OS into the eMMC. Then I can remove the SD card and the board can boot directly from the eMMC uh, storage. Okay, so I set uh, this board in the network of my home as a server and now I will show you how to log in. I use Putty in Windows. And this is what we see when we log in into the Orange Pi Zero Plus 2. We have some useful information from Armbian. We see what we are using 13% of the RAM memory. The SOC is at 70 degrees of temperature. We, we are using 26% of the eMMC memory. We see the uptime, IP, etc. And now I will run some commands to show the performances of this board. We start with systemd analyze that shows a boot time of 28 seconds. This is a bit slow because I was doing some tests recently. With the fresh installation, it uh, had around 18 seconds. Then I had Samba, it was around 24 seconds. So this is what you can expect from this board. Then let's look at the tasks. We see three Boeing, one dump, 1090. These are the two things, the two main objectives why I bought this single board is to run the, to serve as a server, to run Boeing simulations and to build an ADSB station which is the dump 1090 task that I will explain later. Then I will run this command to monitor the board, we see the CPU frequency, the load, and here the temperature of the system on a chip. Now it's running at almost 100% of the CPU, so that's why we see temperatures close to 70 degrees. Next, uh, let's talk about the two main things I'm using this board for. Ah, I forgot, first I show you this monitor, you can install this to the Orange Pi and then you can monitor uh, things like the temperature, we see that we are using a long term uh, Ubuntu distribution, here we see the load of the CPU, the temperature, and we can mm, see this graphical interface in the website, uh, inputting the IP address plus this, uh, in any machine that is connecting connected to the same network as the Orange Spy. Next we go to the ADSB base. This is a map of the planes that I'm detecting now with the ADSB base. I will not go into details uh, about the uh, ADSB and uh, plane tracking, but I have a little antenna and a radio, radio decoder connected to the Orange Pi, and this is outside the window of my home in this point here. 
and I see the planes around me like at uh, 150, 200 kilometers far away. And at the same time, I'm updating this data to some database, which is flight aware. And if you are used to track planes, for instance, in Radar24, flight aware, these thanks to ATSB bases that are around the world and put all the data together like the one I have in my orange pie. We see some statistics. I, this is the only received reports. We see that I started with the orange pie like five days ago. Coverage graph, etc. Next thing, and maybe the most interesting, is about Boeing. Boeing is an open source software for volunteer computing. And in particular, I'm participating in the Universe at Home project. You see that in my list of computers, we have uh, Orange Pi and Raspberry Pi. Raspberry Pi is dead, but it's still in the track of my user in Universe Home. And now I only have Orange Pi as a server. So I'm using this headless server to run simulations the 24 hours of the day for this non-lucrative project, which uh, the purpose is to run simulations about the universe to better um, understand the future and the, the uh, things like the fate of uh, galaxies, black holes, etc. So maybe you already know how to use Boeing uh, using a graphical interface in your computer, but what I'm doing here, because I'm running a Linux distribution in the Orange Pi without desktop, it's a headless version. I'm running, I'm running the Boeing client in the Orange Pi, but I don't have a graphical interface directly installed in the Orange Pi. So what I do is to open the Boeing, one second, the Boeing manager in the computer that is connected to the same network. And then I introduce the IP of the Orange Pi. In this way, I can control the project which is running in the Orange Pi at this moment. We see that three tasks are running, two are waiting. I said to use three out of the four cores because I want to leave one free for the ADSB base. So here I can manage the, my task, like uh, computing preferences, etc. see the remaining time, statistics, and everything. Last thing that I want to show you in this video is the microphone that is integrated in the hat that I also purchased for the Orange Pi Zero Plus 2. And I will run this command. And now this command uh, told the microphone to, to register the sound of the Orange Pi. I will stop the command. Oh, sorry, I didn't record it in the proper folder. Because I installed Samba as a file server, so I need to to record this in the proper folder to be able to to read from my computer connected in the same network. So this is home. This is in share. That's correct. Let's run the command again. So now the microphone is uh, recording the song. The orange pie is like at three meters from me inside the home. And now we listen to the file as it is recorded in the EMMC of the, of the orange pie. And we will do, we will do, is, do this uh, over the network since I install a Samba's file server in which this file is being recorded. I go to the Windows Explorer, Orange, it's here, in this folder. And I told the recording to be called video.wab. So now the microphone is uh, recording the song. The Orange Pi is like at three meters from me inside the home. 
And now we listen to the file as it is recorded in the EMMC of the Orange, of the orange file. And we will do, we will do this, do this uh, over the network since I install a Samba file server in which this file is being recorded. And this is the kind of sound that you get from the microphone um, embedded in the board of the, of, uh, embedded on the head that comes with the Orange Pi board. Okay, I hope that you enjoyed the video and uh, I hope to make a vid other videos soon about other features or other things, projects that I do in my Orange Pi 02 Plus. Bye.